Hey guys, I am super excited about this vibration plate workout. It's a little different than what we're usually doing because I am challenging us with our strength band here. Um, this is a medium weight strength band and I also have my five pound weights. So we're gonna do it all. We're gonna get the most out of our 15 minutes. So I've set my vibration plate for two. You can go higher if you want to. We're gonna be doing a lot of balancing work. So I just want you to be taking that into consideration. I want you to be safe during this. We're gonna be doing some sidestepping um, and some different moves that are gonna require a lot of concentration. So keep that in mind. I have mine on a two because of that reason. We're gonna put on our bands. I tried doing this on the plate earlier today and it was not a pretty scene. So definitely it, um, while you're not mounted on the plate. Above the knees always with the bands. And so we can go ahead, we can grab our weights, we can turn our machine on. Good, and then let's get on, let's get going. So we're gonna start with some soothing, cleansing. Shoulders up to your ears, blow it out. Deep breath in, blow it out. Deep breath in, blow it out. We are going to start with our heels together. Okay, so this first position for all my ballerina. Shoulders up and back, you want that torso really tall and strong. Abs tight, that is our foundation. We're going to start with our arms just resting by our hips. And we're just going to go down. Go down as far as you can go. And then up, squeeze those glutes. Okay, zipper. Down and up. And this should be nice and graceful. So you can add your arms ever so slightly. We are warming up. So keep that in mind. Fast, too furious, too soon into the game here. <laughs> Easy. The squeezing I want good though. Because we are going to be igniting the whole body today. To this. And we are going to change it in four. Three. Very graceful. Two. And one. Now we're going to pulse it. Pulse it. You will feel this pretty quickly. It's a very deceiving, you know, I, I think also when you have the band on, you know, if you did this without the band, you'd be like, okay, it's like, it's not that bad. You put the band on, it is a game changer. But we're at the point now where we've had like, probably our machines for a little while longer. We're trying to not only advance as we're using it, we are trying to challenge ourselves. Balance on this machine is incredible. It's hard, but it is so good. So we're gonna be really giving that a go today. And do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna hold it down. Arms are gonna go up. I want you to lift that right heel and just do a little squat. Left heel little squat. We are like feeling those outsides and warming up those calves. We're going to bring in those arms in four, three, two, one. Hold that right heel up. We are going to do some bicep curls while we're pulsing. So we're going to pulse with the bicep curl. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now pulse it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Other side. Left heel. Now we're going to bring the biceps up and a little squat down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, hold it in pulse, eight, seven, six, five, 
four, three, two, one. Nice job. We're going to bring those feet together. Just a little, like a, a fist in between your feet if you're going to try to make that kind of a whiff. Drop it down. What I want you to do is just make sure your feet are on the plate correctly and that they're not hanging off. We're going to press those knees out and in. Out and in. So we're going to stay in that spot. If you want to go lower, drop it an inch or two, as long as you feel comfortable. Again, form is everything when we're doing these exercises and safety. So abs tight, back straight, keep pulsing. We're going to, now that we're comfortable in this position, we're going to punch that arm to the ceiling, alternating as we are doing this move. Now, it takes a little coordination. It's not the easiest move, but we are challenging ourselves today. So enjoy the burn. You're welcome. We're going to do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now we are going to try to get on our toes. All right, so I'm looking at my feet because I don't want to fall off this leg. So our, gonna, our toes are going to go up and down, and then we open our legs. So up, down, open. Up, down, open. We're only going to do eight of these. So we're going to do four more. That's four, three, two, last one, and then we're just going to hold it down. Arms go to the back. We're going to do some tricep kickbacks. We're going to do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now we're going to hold our arms, wrist up to the ceiling. We're going to pull it back. We're going to work that back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hands go in the front. We are going to take the smallest step to the side. Smallest, okay? So literally, mini baby step to the side. Mini baby step to the side. If you start to get more comfortable, we do a little squat. When I say this is so super tiny, it's almost like we're barely stepping. So I don't want you to try to stay towards the middle of your vibration plate. You're going to feel this very much so but it's a little dangerous so i just want you to every once in a while just look at your feet and make sure if you want to look at your feet the entire time for safety i'm good with that if you would like you can start doing some biceps alternating biceps as well might as well get as much as we can in now we're going to change it to a hammer curl two, three, it's like a little cardio on the plate, but again, if you don't feel cat care comfortable, you can drop the weights, or you can just not do this at all, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, now we're going to keep our feet, again, a little, with your, like, almost like you have your fist in between, arms up. We're going to pop that right knee, then the left knee. Right, left, right, left. Good job. Keep doing that. Arms up to the side. We're going to lift them up, down, up, down. Good job, guys. It is burning doing lots of good things for our body today and really taking it to another level and that's what this is all about are we gonna 
you know, keep having fun, work out, challenge ourselves. Lots of benefits happening here. Keep those legs tight, I don't want anyone hurting their back. And do four, three, two, one. Stand up or shake it out. Okay, this is more challenging. We are going to lift. When I say this, we're going to open back. Arms are hanging to the side. We're going to lift it up. Extend. Up. Make sure your foot is on that plate and secure before we lift the other foot. If you need to look down at your feet, just to make sure they're there before you do it, I'd rather you be doing this slower and just be intentional to balance. Working. Breathe. Up. Down. She might be hanging on. So after. But we're doing something very <laughs> difficult. We're doing it together. So that's nice. We're going to do one more on each side. I feel like my abs aren't as tight as they should be. My foot. Good. Job. Now we're going to go all the way to the left side of the plate. Okay? Make sure your feet are on. Take a little check just to make sure. And we are going to tap underneath. We're going to tap to that right side for eight, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now we are going to lift that leg that's out up. So you can put your arms here. I feel like it's easier for balance. Abs tight for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Other side. Now we're on the right side of the plate. Watch your feet. Make sure you're on good. Okay, here we go. Micro bend those knees. We're gonna step out, in, out, in. We have six, five, four, three, two, one. And then we're gonna put that right leg up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna stand legs wide, as wide as it could possibly be. If you can do this, your toes paint like pointing towards the corners of the room. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna dangle our arms right in front of us. We're going to go down, upright row. Down, upright row. When you take this band off, you're gonna be like, oh my gosh, even if you did these exercises without the band, it's still gonna be challenging, but not as challenging as this. Like I am sweating and we are just actually going pretty slowly through these moves. I want you to really squeeze those glutes and you can exaggerate the moves. And really, the more you exaggerate these moves, the more calories you're going to burn. So I want you to remember that. It's harder when you first start. Once you start getting more comfortable, you know, I always say start low and slow. So if you need to start this workout at a mode one, and build yourself up. We have, I have four modes on mine. I know every machine is different, but I've tried this on a three and it was hard. <laughs> so we're gonna get there. Baby steps, give yourself some grace. We'll do four, three, two, and one. We're gonna hold it down and pulse it. You put your elbows into your waist and just go in and out. Work that back. 
open up the, I like all these chest openers, I always think feel amazing to me. My shoulders are always hunching forward. You're gonna hear me talk about this. It's my, one of my biggest complaints. I don't love it. But these exercise re exercises really do help. Whew. Couple more. Now we're going to hold it. Shoulders up and back. Arms go in the front. We're gonna alternate, lifting it up. Do not think about your abs being totally on fire right now. I mean your abs, your arms, your legs. My abs actually aren't quite on fire yet, but they're what it's keeping me in good body position for this vibration plate. So you're gonna do a few more. And do four, three, two, and one. Now that we are almost done, we're gonna do one deep, really deep, big squat down, up, down, and up. One more, down, and up. We're going to drop these weights. I am all done with that. We're gonna take off our bands oh my gosh i feel like my legs weigh nothing like they feel so light right now we are going to pop, pop our heel on our vibrating plate and just reach down and give yourself a well-deserved stretch that was not something that i do every day <laughs> it's like a special treat for our bodies today um, but it is super good for you so i'm glad you were able to at least try it um, we'll get there. We'll keep doing different workouts. You can absolutely send me any ideas that you have for workouts. I'm happy to try anything with all kinds of equipment. Take a deep breath in, blow it out, push it out, go into a nice rag doll. It's one of my favorite stretches. Just release your head and your neck. Shake your head no and yes. This feels so nice just to like let all that stress just roll off your back. You don't want to think anything about it. You did so good for your body today. I'm so proud of all of you. I'm really proud that if you did that um, weight band, like I am telling you, that is a game changer. <laughs> we are just going to grab our ankle, do a nice quad stretch. Um, definitely hit subscribe like this video if you enjoyed it. I know it wasn't the easiest, but I'm sure you all did a great job. It was definitely difficult for me the first time I did it. I always say it's okay. Like we don't have to be perfect at anything that we start. It's all part of the process where we just keep building up and we just keep bettering ourselves. And every workout is a good workout. So you did something amazing for your bodies today and you should be really proud about that. Deep breath in, blow it out other side breath in I'm like having like balance challenges today <laughs> after our balancing workout I think I'm all, all balanced out we're gonna clasp our hands in the back look up good job you guys shake it out hope you work out with me again you have a beautiful week